Adjusting the levels on both tracks, this is where we are now. A lot closer, except for the sky. So what should we do with the sky? Secondary color corrector works with one color. Perhaps if we use secondary color corrector, we can just bring this sky down enough and leave the rest of the image the same. Using a combination of levels and secondary color corrector on track two and just levels on track one, I've been able to get a pretty good match. It looks a lot better now than it did before. The sky is pretty close. The water is pretty close. Let's add an additional secondary color corrector. And this one, we're going to work on the water. Select the effect range. Let's choose the adjustment color. Let's do this right. Click on the clip, copy to the clipboard, select the left half, and come back over here. Now, let's go. Let's see the effect of each of these controls. If we decrease the gain, we're still in the wrong ballpark here. Hmm. I think at this point, if we just go back to levels and we'll work with levels just a little bit more like that, I think we're about as close as we can get. Let's go back to the first one. Let's take a look at the secondary color corrector on this one, see if we can do anything with the sky. I've been tweaking the settings on track one and track two, levels and color corrector secondary. One tweak after another, and this is about as good as it's going to get. Very close. Close enough? Yeah. Color matching in Vegas.